After overhearing Billy Abbott, Jason Thompson speak to Devin Winters, Brighton James at the Society, Jack Abbott, Peter Birdman, from the young and the restless, Y and R, draws Billy Abbott, Jason Thompson, aside, as the Y and R recap for Thursday, September 21 suggests. Billy claims that he was honest with Devin about the situation involving Ashley Abbott, Eileen Davidson, and Tucker's fight. Jack is skeptical that it will make a difference in the outcome. Even more frightening is the possibility that Devin will let Tucker know that they are coming for him. Billy says that perhaps this would be a positive development in the situation. After the confrontation with Jack, Billy decides to take a drink and reflect on the situation at the Jazz Lounge. He pulls out his phone and sends Tucker a message, asking him to meet up with him so that they can discuss something crucial. Nikki Newman, who is played by Melody Thomas Scott, observes Audra and Kyle sitting together and makes a remark about how close they appear to be. Audra explains that they are talking about business behind her cover. Nikki insists on understanding the topic of their conversation. They constitute some essential aspects of the business. Nikki is not persuaded by the argument. Nikki distracts Audra and tells her that it is not a good idea to interact with Kyle outside of the Newman Media umbrella. Audra acknowledges that she still has feelings for Kyle, but she abides by Nikki's restrictions. According to a spoiler for The Young and the Restless, Nikki is skeptical of Kyle's ability to exercise self-control. She is of the opinion that it would be better if they separated Kyle and Newman. Audra makes numerous attempts to dissuade Nikki from dismissing Kyle, but her words fall on deaf ears. Nikki reveals to Audra that despite the fact that she was thinking about terminating her, she ultimately chose to give her another chance. Nikki gives Audra the order to inform Kyle that he is jobless. At Newman Enterprises, Lily Winters, Crystal Kahlil, is informed by Victor Newman, Eric Braden, that the identity of the new investor would be disclosed in the near future. He entreats her to put her faith in him. The only thing Victor is willing to disclose is that this individual approached him and that CW is very important to them. Their talk is suddenly cut off by Victoria Newman, who is played by Amelia Heinel. After Lily has left the office, Victoria inquires as to the purpose of Lily's presence there. Victoria is not going to provide an explanation. When she found out that he had previously possessed Chancellor Winter's stock, but had recently sold it, she was taken aback. Spoilers for Young and the restless state that Victoria looks at the spot where her portrait used to be hung. She is perplexed as to why he took hers down in order to hang his own image. Victoria claims that she is being punished by him, but she is uncertain of the reason why. Victoria is informed by Victor that the corporation is fractured and that she is to blame for this state of affairs. Victoria is under the impression that her father purposely prepared her for failure. Victor had the impression that she would collaborate with her brothers and establish a unified front, but this never ended up being the case. Nikki runs into the office in a hurry to find out what the commotion and screams are about. Nikki does not believe that it is necessary for them to discuss this matter right away because she and Victor are going on vacation. At the penthouse, Lily has arranged to meet with Devon. She ruminates about who the new shareholder on the young and the restless might be, according to young and the restless spoilers. She clarifies that Victor did not provide her with any information at any point. Lily and Devon have different opinions regarding the identity of the new owner. He is under the impression that Tucker is not interested in Seagull. In addition to this, the shares would not grant him a controlling ownership in the company. Spoilers for Young and the Restless state that Devon said that he and Billy had an odd talk. Devon reveals to him that her former boyfriend had previously cautioned him about the threat posed by Tucker.
They are all in agreement that Billy is most likely simply trying to exacerbate the situation. Lily is concerned that Tucker is the one responsible for this. She strongly recommends to her brother that he does not underestimate Tucker. Stephen recognizes and acknowledges the problem, but he is certain that Tucker is not the guy. Kyle decides to have a drink at the GCAC bar so that he may reflect on the path that his life is taking. He is joined by Victor. Kyle is upset that Audra sacked him from his job. Kyle is told by Victor that he shouldn't be working at Newman, but rather at Jabad instead. Stay tuned to CDL for more juicy spoilers, news, and casting developments on the young and the restless Y and R.